Hi everybody, it's Josh Ellsworth from Stalls, and I'm excited to showcase the new all-in-one print shop software, Stalls Fulfill Engine. It's gonna help you to go out and acquire more orders through a variety of ways. I'm gonna demonstrate every way to you, and it's gonna help you to manage those orders all the way through the shop floor, out to your customer, through a variety of print processes. So, let's start by talking about all of the different ways that you can sell with Stalls Fulfill Engine. This is an e-commerce sales technology. And so naturally, you're able to launch white label stores. That's the first big way that you can sell with Fulfill Engine. When we think about white label stores, there are two types. There's a standard store. That's where we're gonna accept credit card as payment directly to your account that'll be integrated. And there's also a points-based store. Points-based stores are great for corporations or businesses that want to gift points to employees at onboarding, at milestones, and ultimately have those points be redeemed for branded merch or other products that can be positioned and sold through Fulfill Engine. Now, when we look at these white label stores, the first one we're looking at is showing us the traditional white label store. The domain name will be whatever you want to come up with for your client's name, .checkoutstores.com, okay? You can share this link directly with that client and they can do all of the shopping at this store. Their fans and supporters or employees can check out with a credit card. And then we'll show you just in a bit how you can bring those orders in and make them or choose to outsource those orders if you want. Now the point store is a little bit different. You're able to assign a point value to each item in the store. So every item can be one point or if you wanna have more points be redeemed for a jacket or maybe a backpack, something like that, you create the points values that you want to be redeemed. Now, something uh, great about Fulfill Engine is the embeddable store. The embeddable stores allows you to take a white label store, any of the two types that we just covered, and actually embed that into your client's website. So if your client already has a website, now they can add branded merch within that same experience. As you're seeing here, this is a company that does tours in Charleston, South Carolina. Okay, their main business is booking private tours or group tours and showing people around Charleston. But this area of the website shows you an embeddable Fulfill Engine merch store right inside of their existing website. That's a huge deal. So they can keep traffic there and they can really, ma really maximize that traffic with branded merch. I'm sure you can think of a ton of ways to deploy this across a variety of customer types. And so with Fulfill Engine, you can launch unlimited stores, all three types of stores, and be collecting orders through those e-commerce stores uh, that can ship out direct to customers that purchase on behalf of the business. You can also build products to push to existing Shopify stores. Shopify is one of the global leaders in e-commerce stores. They're very feature rich with lots of uh, user design experience opportunities for you to create, okay? So if you want something, spend a little more time, it's a little more advanced, launch a Shopify store. Now within that Shopify store, as long as you're above the base level package, you can use the Fulfill Engine Builder to be able to create products to push out to sell right on that store. We're looking at an example here that you can see it's very feature rich. We navigate through the products, all the design, all the promotion design on Shopify. All we're doing is building the products through Fulfill Engine to push them out to the store. Now, one more way to take an order. Those were the four e-commerce methods. The other way that you can take an order through Fulfill Engine is a feature called Quote to Order. This will allow you to create a quote You'll build your products with your decorations. You'll select the quantities that you wanna create for this quote after selecting your item, okay? So 15 larges, 10 mediums, et cetera, et cetera. We can build that out all simultaneously for this bulk order or small order, doesn't really matter. And what I'm gonna do is I'm going to add those products to a cart and then click the button to create a quote. When we create a quote, it creates a link that we can send out to the customer where they can log into that order. We can also choose to send an email right through the system with that quote affixed. In either case, the customer gets the quote, they can enter their credit card information and complete the same checkout experience so it funnels into your fulfillment program. Also note that the customer can edit quantities on the quote, right? This pricing is all based on the pricing you set up in the system under your Fulfill Engine account. So giving the customer the power to change from 10 larges to in 10 mediums to maybe add a couple more pieces in each size, very easy for them to build it and maintain that pricing so you're making the profit that you expect 
but not having to spend extra time in the back and forth, okay? So, tons of ways to go out and capture orders through Fulfill Engine. Now, all of these ways to capture orders rely on having a great product building experience. How Fulfill Engine is different than other e-commerce platforms out there is when you are building the product, you are actually building the manufacturing file. That's what's so awesome about the system because now with a manufacturing file, I can make very efficiently and do a lot of things that I'll show you in a moment, even at quantities of one piece profitably. Okay, so really quick on the product build. Fulfill Engine is integrated with lots of suppliers and definitely the big three. That's Sanmar, Alpha Broder, and SNS Activewear. So basically what you do is we're gonna click create a product. We're gonna choose the decoration method and there are many supported that we're gonna create with. And at that point, I'm going to select the blank from the full catalog. It's pulling all the inventory from the integrated suppliers that are compatible with the decoration process that you've selected. Now, it prompts us to bring in the art. If we wanna do embroidery, we're gonna bring in the DST file right here. If we wanna do direct to film transfers, we're gonna bring in that file as well. As you can see, these blanks are beautifully drawn and they're pixel perfect. So no more of the mock-ups that go out to your website where the blanks are all tilted a different direction and they're not true to size. Every garment, every product that's integrated in Fulfill Engine is true to size, which means I can bring my production file for my transfer, for my embroidery, for my direct garment printing, for my screen printing, for whatever the process, at the actual size and place it in the location of exactly where I want it in the manufacturing file. So I wanna do a left chest design, click the left chest, it gives you the box in the printable area and I can bring my logo in. Wanna do a front print, you can do that too. You can move your design within the printable area box to place it. Back prints, sleeve prints, unique locations based on the item you're selecting like a backpack. We help you to decorate it and make the manufacturing file very easily. Okay. So we built lots of products, right? We pushed these products in different decoration methods out to lots of different collection sources, lots of stores in quotes. Now, if you're good at sales and marketing, orders are coming in, okay? When orders come in, they're coming into something called a batch through Fulfill Engine. Now, when we think about the batch technology, a batch equals a time period. It could be a week, a day, an hour. All the orders coming to the system are coming into whatever batch is open. As you see here, we have some batches that have been closed and we have a batch that's open. With an open batch, you can choose to close that batch on your own manually and say, hey, we wanna start working on all these orders that came through over this time period. Or you can set up automated batch closing. So that batch can close for you based on maybe a free shipping threshold that you want from the blank supplier once you collect enough orders to get your shipping for free. So lots of flexibility, lots of functionality with batching. And so orders can come in, two orders from this store, two orders from that store, one order from this store, 20 orders from another store. Doesn't matter what store the sale happens on, doesn't matter the decoration technique, they're all consumed into this batch together until you close it. When you close it, something awesome happens. We're gonna process this batch, and during this moment, all of the products that you've created, the blank apparel and the blank products are being sourced automatically on your account. So when you set up your Fulfill Engine account, you're gonna set up your credentials for your blank apparel wholesale accounts from SNS or Sanmar or Alpha Broder, okay? You're going to pre-authorize that we're able to order on behalf of you on those accounts, but we're actually gonna order on your account number. So we close the batch, all the POs get placed out to those blank apparel suppliers. You never have to log into their website. Those orders will come in and arrive to you, okay? And then we go into the receiving station. Now in the receiving station on Fulfill Engine, Basically, this is where we are collecting all the blanks and setting them off into the manufacturing process, okay? So when we talk about receiving, I'm going to open the bag that I've received from the blank apparel wholesaler once it's arrived with my free shipping, and then I'm going to enter the PO number or scan the barcode into the Fulfill Engine system. Make sure you have a little zebra printer by your receiving station and you have that station set up on the back end. Immediately upon receipt of these, it'll print out QR code stickers on your zebra printer that need to be affixed to each garment. That sticker is your work order. No more paper forms, just a sticker that gets applied to the inside of the shirt or maybe on the lower left hand of the shirt, somewhere on the product that's not gonna impact the printing of that logo. That sticker, that QR code is your work order. It's gonna take that piece all the way through the process to the shipping line. 
Now, Fulfill Engine thinks about this a little bit different. Yes, they were orders when they, they came in. They're not orders as they're flowing through your shop until we reach the end shipping line, where it's gonna pull those products back together that are flowing through different departments in your shop. So again, shipping, we know this product uh, is stickered to our large t-shirt, our black shirt, and we know what, what department it needs to flow through. Stack up all of your garments that are gonna flow into your heat press department for direct to film printing and move those over into the heat press application station. If it's going through embroidery, create those together and batch push them to your embroidery machine. Once you get to your machine in our heat press department, it's very simple. That same QR code sticker that I'm illustrating here live from the show that's printed on this paper would be on the garment, right? On the size garment, on the color. We're going to scan that and instantly using the Fulfill Engine software, it's gonna pull a mock-up of what the customer saw when they purchased. So we know the placement, the logo's true to size that we've ordered from the direct-to-film transfer, and all we need to do is match the two together. What's really awesome about this is if you have the latest heat press equipment from Hotronics, the Hotronics Pro Place IQ, you can connect Fulfill Engine to that uh, Pro Place IQ automatically, and it will project the image placement onto the garment. Now it's as simple as matching the Ultra Color Max direct to film transfer, the logo to the light. A perfect left chest placement on this mint green shirt, heat apply it for the 10 to 12 seconds and complete the true hot peel. Now let's move on to the back of the shirt. Spin the shirt right on the press. Again, I'll just tap this touch screen. I have a micro PC set up and a monitor uh, that has a touch screen affixed right to my heat press here. I'm gonna click on the back print and it immediately toggles to the back print. Now I'm able to place that logo to the light and complete the application. What's great about this heat press system for heat printing is there's no downtime. We have the dual base machine. So as an operator is pressing one side, they can be loading the other side using the projection. It's plenty of time to place it and move through the production workflow. Now, something I wanna make sure that you didn't miss. These direct to film transfers were sourced automatically during that batching process as well. So if you're setting up with transfers from stalls, you can order those right through the Fulfill Engine system without ever having to upload your artwork on stalls.com or go through that art upload process. It orders exactly what you need. If you batch and push the order, the transfers, if you order by 8 a.m. Eastern, they ship the very same day. They arrive to most places in the U.S. market within two business days, and so we're pressing in just a few days from when the order arrived. That's the magic of Fulfill Engine and Print On Demand. We wanna keep our stores open so we can ship orders right away. People don't have to wait weeks. They can wear the apparel. Others in the group can see the apparel and we can grow more sales for everybody involved in the equation. Now, Fulfill Engine not only runs the heat press department, it can run any production process in your shop. As you can see here, we have the same micro PC and monitor attached to our single head embroidery machine. We scan the QR code on this beanie. We make sure we hoop the beanie, load it onto the embroidery machine, and it knows the color sequence and the thread to be able to sew the garment out. So when you set up your Fulfill Engine account, part of that setup is specifying what threads you have on what spools on what machines in your shop. So we know how to receive that order, how to move it to the right department, and that you can get that automation, that efficiency in the embroidery department to sew these products out. It also powers scan to print for direct to garment printing. So whether you're running this brother uh, direct to garment printer like you see here, or another branded direct to garment printer, we can scan, we get that same display, and it prints directly onto our shirt. It also supports internal inventory. So in this particular case, you can see the operator picked the garment off of the shelf that they were holding in internal inventory instead of outsourcing it. It has some light inventory management capabilities for you to do that. Okay, so hopefully this is making sense and providing a lot of power. Now, we have all these garments created for this order in different departments in the shop, all for different web stores. The next step, as we've completed quality control throughout the process is move it to a final quality control step at the shipping line. Install Fulfill Engine or launch Fulfill Engine through the cloud software uh, right on the internet browser in the shipping line. I'm gonna scan that same QR code. At that point, it'll print a shipping label. If this is a one of one order, the customer in the cart only ordered one item, it'll print the shipping label right away, package it up and ship it out. Now, if there were maybe three items coming across in this order, it will tell me this is item one of three. Place it in bin B2 while you wait on the other two items. So it does have dynamic binning. And so what it will do is it will tell you based on the weight of the order that's going to the client, whether you need a small, medium, or large bin, and it will tell you where to place it. 
So that's your holding area until the last piece gets scanned at the shipping line. When the last piece is scanned, it'll tell you go retrieve the other two items on this three-piece order from bin B4. You retrieve those items, do a final QC check and sign off that all the items are there and they're the quality we expect, and it'll print the shipping label, and we're sending that order out the door directly to the consumer. The fill engine is powerful for running your own production. From e-commerce to quote to order, all the way to the shipping line, this is a way that you can do print on demand across a variety of decoration processes in quantities of one. It's also a way you can scale and outsource, so I don't want you to miss this part. Sometimes, with well, your business model, it makes sense to do it all in-house. But sometimes you may have seasonality or you may be better at sales and marketing and you wanna outsource. With Fulfill Engine, we have certified stalls and Fulfill Engine decorators that can handle the printing for you across these production processes. So not quite ready to invest in screen printing, you can create a bulk quote and send a bulk screen printing order, all with pricing created from your price sheet. Not quite ready to do embroidery in-house or even direct-to-film or direct-to-garment printing, you can launch an entire store for print-on-demand fulfillment through one of our contract partners. Our contract partners, the quality is great, they're managed very well, and you can have confidence that the product that arrives to your customer is going to be the quality you expect, even on items that are made there versus in your shop. Being able to outsource your business, being able to decorate in-house, being able to have a hybrid model that adapts with your business and your growth plans makes an extremely scalable solution. So I would encourage you, schedule a demo with one of our team members, learn more about Fulfill Engine for your specific business case, and hopefully you can see that this solution can be the all-in-one shop software for your business. Thanks for watching.